Hello and welcome to this reaction of Game of Thrones. We are on season six, episode five. Uh, scrolling down a little bit so I can kind of see where we are at. You know, bad remembering and all. Uh, so yeah, uh, there's just things going on all over the world. Well, I, I'm not gonna beat a dead horse and recap everything that you guys probably already know anyway. So, without further ado, let's just get to the show. Far as Molestown. I rode north for the Knights of the Vale to come to your aid. They're encamped at Moat Kaelin as we speak. To come to my aid. Did you know about Ramsay? Probably. If you didn't know, you're an idiot. If you did know, you're my enemy. Would you like to hear about our wedding night? Oh, he knows. I can't begin to contemplate. What do you think he did to me? He knows. Lady Sansa asked you a question. To beat you? Yes, he enjoyed that. What else do you think he did? I don't need you anymore. You can't protect me. You won't even be able to protect yourself if I tell Brienne to cut you down. And why shouldn't I? You probably actually do need him. You want me to beg for my life? If that's what you want, I will. Wait, Uncle. Brendan, the Blackfish, has gathered what remains of the Tully forces and retaken River Run. You might consider seeking him out. The time may come when you need an army loyal to you. I have an army. Your brother's army. You're gonna whoop your ass without a stick. I still think that's the faceless god. He was no one. The many faced god taught him how to shed his face and how to give the gift. The men taught others in exchange for their service. Many served. Many more gifts were given. Soon all the masters and overseers were gone, and the faceless men fled. A girl has been given a second chance. There will not be a third. One way or another, a face will be added to the hall. <laughs> One way or another. Blood. And our son alone on that cold, cold throne, without a guiding hand. <laughs> who will teach him strength? Who will teach him grace? To whom will he turn when it's time to learn to look darkness in the face? Ned Stark will do fine. Now bring me more wine. This is a test. All is well. They're testing I you. I have here a decree. To our children, may they have your talent and your filthy mind. <laughs> a girl will poison the rum. Lady Crane is the only one who drinks it. Ah, we're back in the time tree. I hope they explain this because this is just weird. Is this him just showing knowledge or is this actually happening? Wow, okay. Yo! I 
claim the salt throne. We've never had a queen. Not once. There are many things we've never done. We've never made our mark upon the world. The great lords of Westeros pay us no mind until our little raids buzz through their kingdoms long enough to become a nuisance. Kneel to your sister. I am Theon Greyjoy. Last living son of Balon Greyjoy. And she is your rightful ruler. She actually thought he was going to do it for a minute. I did too. I'm Euron Greyjoy. I claim the salt throne. Of course he does. Threw him right over a road bridge and watched him fall. He was leading us nowhere, and we would still be heading there if it weren't for me. No one loved him. No one wanted to follow him. He led us into two wars we couldn't win. I apologize to you all for not killing him years ago, because I'm the one who knows how to use it. I've been all over the world. I've seen more of it than all of you combined. And across the sea, there is a person who hates the great lords of Westeros just as much as we do. Someone with a large army, three large dragons, and no husband. I paid the iron price, and here I stand. Wait! Kill him. Oh, they just give it to him? There's no way he's dead, right? Oh, please say he's dead. <laughs> It'd just be too funny. Where are my niece and nephew? Let's go murder them. Build me a thousand ships, and I will give you this world. You really think you're gonna entice her? Mm. Good luck, dude. Ooh, it's getting worse. Quick. Is there a cure? I don't know. How long does it take? Do not walk away from your queen, Jura the Andal. You have not been dismissed. You pledged yourself to me. You swore to obey my commands for the rest of your life. Can you banish him twice? Well, I command you to find the cure. Oh, that's not the last we see of him. In the last fortnight since our pact with the Masters, how many killings have been carried out by the Sons of the Harpy? None. And how many Masters have been butchered by the Freemen? Two. We brought about an end to the violence. We need someone the people trust. Someone they know cannot be bought or influenced. Sounds like quite the hero. Where will we find him? Who said anything about him? He's looking at her. Daenerys Storborn is the one who was promised. From the fire, she was reborn to remake the world. Ah. Uh. She has freed the slaves from their chains and crucified the masters for their the prophecies. She did indeed. Her dragons are fire made flesh. Sounds most a man excellent. Named Stannis Baratheon was anointed as the chosen one by one of your priestesses. He too had a glorious destiny. 
He attacked King's Landing and was soundly defeated by the man standing beside me. Last I'd heard, he'd been defeated again, this time at Winterfell. Terrible things. I don't believe that at all. Take what happened to you, Lord Varys, when you were a child. If not hmm. for your mutilation at the hand of a second-rate sorcerer, you wouldn't be here. Helping the Lord's Chosen bring his light into the world. We serve the same queen. If you are her true friend, you have nothing to fear from me. That's the first time this entire show I've seen him dumbfounded. Zombies. I didn't mean to. No the more flashbacks, huh? The time for what? For you to become me. But am I ready? No. We can't be headed their father. I don't think we can count on them either. How well do you know the North, Sir Davos? Precious little, my lady. My father always said Northerners are different, more loyal. Or suspicious of outsiders. They may well be loyal, but how many rose up against the Boltons when they betrayed your family? Robert Ramsey's own door. I don't doubt it. But John doesn't have the Stark name. No, but I do. Is it, hold on, John is she is every bit as much Ned Stark's son as Ramsey is Roose Bolton's. And there are also the Tullys, they're not northern, but they will back us against the Boltons without question. No. You heard them. We need more men. And my uncle has an army. We can send the Blackfish a raven. We can't risk Ramsay intercepting it. It has to be you. Ride for everyone. My uncle will talk to you, and you'll know how to talk to him. What is it? Tip. Yes, he will. Then why did you lie to him when he asked you how you learned about Riverrun? He's not wrong. New dress. I made it myself. Do you like it? Don't knock it down while I'm gone. I'll do my best. Good luck. Yes, you are. Close the bloody gate. <laughs> ah, I wish the big guy was still here. <sighs> He'd be a great Lord Commander for this. What the hell? Here's your creation. Oh no! Run! Run! Wake up! Run! Hold on! Run! Wake up! You need to wake up the old man. You need to take care of that one with the crown.
Oh, not the wolf. Run, wake up. Run, hold on. Listen to your friend, Brandon. Don't get to get a die wolf too. That's wicked. So how's he gonna learn anything? Where are you gonna go that they can't already be at? So Bran is the reason that he doesn't talk. Bran is the reason he only says Hodo because he literally made him have a seizure to the point where he couldn't even say hold the door, which is his whole life's purpose now. Oh. Holy shit. Okay. Um, I'm going to say one thing. As interesting as that is, I don't like the idea of time travel in this universe. Via a tree or a three-eyed raven or whatever's going on. I don't like it. So... I, I think it's I think it's really kind of odd. It doesn't really clear up why his dad could hear him, unless it's that father son connection. I I don't get it. They never explain it. It it doesn't explain why the Night King, as they called him, could touch him. In that realm, um, what kind of supernatural bullshit is going on with the Night King that he can move fire out of the way without doing anything? He can break apart ice just by touching the ground. He can literally revive life, and I'm guessing we're never going to get the answers because the tree witches are all dead. So I don't know. Unless Brain does some more flashbacks without the other teacher, Three-Eyed Raven, but uh, that was a wild ending. So, it looks like like Daenerys is going back to take her kingdoms. It looks like she's apparently the prophesied one. <laughs> so, I, I don't know. Uh, so, do we ever ever, I, I don't care. G give me the spoiler. I just need to know. Did we ever actually find out who 
the Night King is. Like, do we ever figure that out? Is it ever explained? You know, I, we saw him. We saw how he came about. I'm just curious if they ever explain who. Um, you didn't have to tell me who. You could just say yes. I'm fine with. I'm fine with the yes in comments. But um, yeah, I wrote the tree people created the White Walkers. I'm just gonna call them tree witches because we only saw the handful of them. So whatever, and they can make things blow up apparently. So. Uh, and is this finally the change in Santa I've been waiting for for almost six and a half seasons? Six seasons. We'll we'll say we'll say five. You now we'll we'll discount season one. So we're we're talking about five seasons. She actually was standing up for people herself. She basically told Littlefinger off finally. I do believe Littlefinger wants to help her. I also believe Littlefinger knew about Ramsay. Yeah. I'm semi kind of assuming maybe he thought his dad would hold him his reins and not allow him to go crazy like he did. But, uh, wow. Um, lots of intake on this episode. I'm just going to leave it here. I need to, I need to rewatch it. There, it's, there was just so much good things that happened, and I need to know. I need to know what I saw really happened or if I'm just making shit up in my head at this point. But that was a good one. That was a really good one. <laughs> We're halfway through season six. That was a good one. If that's how the rest of the season's going to go... Yo, I understand why so many people say this is such a good season. But, um, hope you guys enjoyed the reaction with me. Don't mind my stunned silence at the end there. I was trying to process what was going on. But like, share, subscribe, hit that comment button. And until next time, take care.